let's see what's happening if we just turn the amplifier to the other side. Now we should have a kind of TX response. Nano VNA on. Amplifier is connected. And power on. Nothing happens. Okay. You see the point is that I just want to have a TX. How can we do that? This is the minor now. So when we have a signal from the minor, a beacon, the amplifier should go on the X and we should see a very clear LED there. Oh, if it's commuting on. Okay, so the radio is on. We have beacons from the gateway, very clear. Really strong beacons. And let's say if we count in the amplifier, same story. I can't say that it's something better or not. Let's, let me take out the antenna. You see, there are really, really strong beacons. So, no more antenna to the radio. It should have... Let me have the gain a little bit. Okay. You see, no antenna, just the adapter. So that's a very tiny reception uh, signal there. Let's keep it like that. Now, if I have this on, I should have better signal. No way, nothing. It's not working. No TX. And the bad point is that we can't measure these things. Let me see. This is the capacitor. We should I should be at that. I am the antenna now. No. It's not working. It's not commuting. Same story with the AB. No TX. Very clear. No TX. What can I do? Nothing else. That's it. So it's just a piece of garbage. I'm sorry to say that. It's only amplifying. Yeah, we have a very clear amplification of uh, 7 point something dB. That's good, but it's not responding to beacons. I have something here. I can see that. Minus 59 dB. But it's not what I'm looking for. Not at all. No chance. Okay, let's put this guy on a CD. Uh, okay, stimulus CD, 869 megahertz. We should see it on the radio. Now very clear, the nano VNA, 868 megahertz. Without the amplifier, with the amplifier, Almost same story. We should see now a huge amplification for TX, but it's not even commuting on TX. And someone suggested to have a preamp or to have another amplifier before this one and to try to push it on the X okay we can do that so let's try the trick uh, I think Adrian suggested that I have the AB amplifier on let's check the amplification and we have like 899 888 dB minus 9.77 and that means like 12 dB amplification with AB. Okay, 12 dB here. Remember that. Okay, this one goes out, this one goes out. This is a lot of signal. This one should make like a song going on TX. Alright, so that's the minor side. 
This is the minor side, yes. And once we connect this to the amplifier, we should have a very clear TX signal, no? It's huge. We have a lot of signal here. Okay, there we go. And now, let's inject this at Akasom input, obviously the minor input, and let's read the output. Of course, we have the bell shape because of the filters, but the numbers are not great at all. 12.79 dB. Everything went up with 1 dB, but of course there is no TX. You see, it's not commuting on TX. We should have that. Let's try a trick. Let me change the stimulus from 400 megahertz to 910. Same story. Anyway, it's a good filtration. I have to admit that. Let's try to connect Akasom the other way. No chance. Nothing happens. And... Okay. Minus 51 dB. And still no TX commuting. Same story, people. Well, nothing else to do for now. Conclusion. This amplifier, Akasom, the way it is now, with a 7.68 dB RX, of course it can be used. It have a filter and that's great because you don't need anything else in your path, in your chain. But it's no transmitting. I don't see any kind of TX commuting. Okay even with a real LoRa beacon, LoRa van beacon from a real gateway. What can I say? These guys are just resellers. I don't think they have the engineering capability of checking these devices and uh, do the expertise or to do the investigation about what's happening here. I'm just, you know, a lot of people ask if I have a reliable, you know, a trusty provider or something like this or a product, a trusty product. No, I don't. So all we have to do people is just to rely in, in the seller's honesty and uh, that's it. Obviously the numbers or evidently the numbers are not lying. These machineries are not lying. So it's exactly what is happening in this box. It's nothing magic, you know, it's electronic and electronic have two kind of states working or not working. <laughs> and it's very clear, this one is not working or not the way they advertise it. With this money, I can buy 10 CPF 5192Z, you know, with very good results. And uh, that's it, that's it. Nothing to do. Okay, I hope it's useful. I'll be back with news if any, uh, don't forget, like, subscribe and uh, you see, have fun, most important, bye bye.